Hello. Hi, in these times of uncertainty and unrest and division, I want to share a breath practice that for me helps to temper uh, my anger and it helps to bring me down out of this swirling and into my body um, because I find I can get stuck in the swirling and in the ruminating and the same cycle of thoughts and this is so awful and what can I do and it's so overwhelming and this is so awful and what can I do and for me I have to pause this and to go here to be able to then choose an intelligent action to move me forward. So Uddiyana Bandha is, it's a breath practice, but more than that, it's an energy practice, a movement of energy. With Uddiyana Bandha, I find it's common to confuse the action, the sort of vacuum suction-like action of Uddiyana with bracing your abdominals. The um, imagine as though someone is going to punch you in the stomach and you're tightening of everything to prevent that punch from going in. And it's a different action than that. Uh, less of a contraction of the abdominals and more of a vacuum created within your abdomen. So I want to show you briefly and then we can do it seated together. So in Uriana, take this off. In Uriana, I think sometimes it's easiest to see. We do a full breath in, short pause at the top, and then a forceful exhale through the mouth. Then hold the breath, no air in or out. And we'll use a little pressure of the hands to help create the scooping of the guts. So I'll show you first the uh, impression of using the abdominal wall, the bracing, and then I'll show you Uddiyana Bandha, okay? Here's Uriyama. So the feeling with Uriyama is more of little bit of bracing with the hands and the suctioning the guts up and in and the idea almost like you're going to spread your ribs apart like you do with an inhale but there's no breath that moves so let's try it and don't worry if it doesn't quite click it takes some practice okay so sit sit cross-legged full breath in through your nose now soft lion stick your tongue out Breathe in through your nose. Soft lion, complete release. Inhale through your nose. Soft lion, complete exhale. Now inhale through your nose. Short pause, prop your hands in front of you, forceful exhale through the mouth. <sighs> pause the breath, push through the hands a bit, suck your belly up and into the ribs and imagine spreading your ribs out wide. When you need to breathe in, relax your belly first. Inhale, lift your head, rise upright. Easy exhale through your nose. 
Long breath in through your nose. Pause briefly. Prop your fingers in front of you. Forceful exhale through your mouth. Pause the breath. Push through the hands, suck your belly up and in. Think of spreading the rib cage out wide, hollow out. When you need your breath, release belly first. Inhale, sit upright. Exhale, easy through your nose. Breathe in fully. Pause. Prop your hands out in front. Forceful exhale through your mouth. Pause the breath. Suck the belly up and in. Flare the ribs out wide. Little pressure with the hands. Hollow hold. Release your belly. Inhale through your nose. Empty it out. One more like this. In through your nose. Short pause. Prop fingers out in front. Forceful exhale. Pause the breath. Suck belly up and in. Think of spreading the rib cage apart. Create that vacuum internally. Hold it just a moment longer. Now release your belly. Full inhale. Sit up tall. Easy exhale through your nose. Breathe in through your nose. Soft exhale through your nose. Keep it going. In and out through your nose and bring awareness to the feeling of your hips on the floor or on your cushion. To the length and the effort or ease with each of your breaths. But also bring awareness to the quality of energy that you feel moving within you. For me, it feels rooted, but bright. And please don't make it into supposed to or should or shouldn't, but please notice the effects for you of playing with harnessing breath and moving energy. Bring your palms together in front of your heart. Bow your chin, raise your chest. And so you take the short pauses to feel the roots to come back into your own body. And then you decide what is the wisest step. One step that you can take right now in the highest service of yourself or in service to the freedom and the happiness of others. time. May the practices be of benefit to you and may they be in service of the freedom and happiness of all beings.